Welcome to uh, the new course that we're offering in Radically Open Dialect Behavioral Therapy, RODBT. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about this course. My name is Dr. Thomas Lynch. I'm the RODBT treatment developer. I'm also a professor emeritus in clinical psychology at the University of Southampton and the director of the Radically Open Institute. So what is this RODBT for line support staff? What's it all about? Well, while most of our RODBT training courses are aimed at therapeutic staff, this training um, is specifically designed for line or support staff who work in mental health care settings and who want to have a better understanding of radically open DBT, but who will not provide the treatment themselves. Okay. Now, you may wonder why we've developed a course specifically for line or support staff who will not offer the treatment themselves. Well, there's actually a scientifically supported reason for this. How about that? Here's the thing. Line and support staff play an important role. The therapeutic relationship between nursing and support staff and patients in intensive mental health care setting plays a pivotal role in achieving positive outcomes. That's what the data shows. Plus, given the extensive time that support staff spend with patients, they can significantly influence a patient's treatment outcomes and progress. And so as a consequence, they need to understand and support the therapeutic principles and protocols of a treatment. And why? Well, for one, to provide appropriate assistance and interventions in case of emergencies or crises. And secondly, to reinforce therapeutic techniques and promote patient progress. And third, to maintain consistency in treatment delivery. So that's why we have created a course just for you, if you're a line staff person listening to this, of course. So what will you learn? Let's talk a little bit about the two-part course. And what we've done is we've divided this training into two parts. And there's the basics, and then there's the um, assessment of over-control part. Now, you can choose to complete one or both, depending on your needs. So let's talk about the RODBT for line support staff. It's called the basics. Now, who is this for? Well, it's for staff who encounter over-controlled clients or their family members on a daily basis and need to know enough about RODBT to you know, explain RODBT per, to prospective clients or their family members when they get asked about it, to understand the language and behaviors that the RODBT trained therapists are using, to support and strengthen RODBT principles and techniques in everyday interactions with patients, this helps the outcomes, to understand why RODBT therapists are using things like teasing or, or therapeutic silliness with their, their clients, and <clears throat> also to manage common maladaptive behaviors that we see among over-controlled individuals, such as pushbacks and don't hurt me. So you're gonna learn all that. Now, let's talk a little bit about the second part. This is the RODBT for line support staff, where we're looking at people that are gonna be ass assess you know, assessing over-control, okay? So who is it for? Again, it's for staff involved with assessment or triage. And in this course, first of all, you're going to learn everything that I just talked about in the basics course, plus some additional things. You're also going to learn the biosocial theory of over-control. And this will help you understand, essentially, what maladaptive over-control is and how it's developed. And this is going to help you in your assessment process. Plus, you're also going to learn uh, how to assess over control using a step-by-step -step approach from, and the measures that are recommended in the RODBT textbook. And by the way, for assessors wishing to deepen their understanding, there's also an on-demand webinar available for purchase called Distinguishing Maladaptive OC from Maladaptive UC. By the way, UC means under control, so distinguishing over control from under controlled personality styles and, and, and people that have those different types of ways of uh, coping or being. And what this does, it, this builds on the assessment webinars 
and it includes also a RODBT interview guide, and I highly recommend it. <clears throat> okay, so where do you find the line support staff courses? Good question. Well, if you think this course is for you or your staff, visit our website and select support staff courses under our training options. And our website, by the way, is radicallyopen.net. And, um, and last but not least, there's one more thing I probably should share with you. That is, the course is not intended to help you understand, you know, it's, it's intended to help you understand more about RODBT so you can support the nursing or therapeutic staff at your clinic, but it's not designed as an instruction for you or the line staff to implement or provide RODBT in, in the way it's intended as the full treatment um, yourself. Um, that's why we don't offer continuing education credits as part of this course. Okay, that's it. I hope you have found this helpful and I hope to see you at one of our courses. Thanks a lot and I wish you well.